All right, so I'm doing a giveaway, but this is not a regular giveaway. There's a lot of things you have to do to enter, okay? So first of all, I need you guys to go to my Twitter post here. I need you to like this, follow me on Twitter, and retweet it. Do all of that, and then you're good. And then go right here. This is Benary's Twitter, all right? Now, he's not going to know about this or all. I don't think Benary watched my videos, okay? I want you guys to go to Benary's recent tweet, all right? This one. Uh, yeah, this one right here. Go to this tweet as soon as this video is published, and I'll put the link to this one and this one down below. I want you guys to go down here and type in ratioed, all right? And just reply. That's all you guys have to do, okay? Just say ratioed and reply, and that's all you have to do. This could be a Goro giveaway. You don't know. It depends on whether I find one or not. So, uh, yeah, if you want to answer, just follow those steps, and uh, yeah, let's get into that video. Okay, so really quick, we're about to hit 43,000 subscribers. If you guys haven't that many yet, I really appreciate it. The goal for me right now is to hit 45,000 before the end of 2020. We have like 10 days left, and I think we can hit that. Now, today's video is a preview video about pretty much everything coming to update one. I'm going to do more of these for every update. I know this update took a while to get out, but there's a lot of content in it. And you guys got to realize it is a paid access game. So we're not going to be like rushing updates. All right. But yeah, tester tested out everything. I didn't really do too much. I'm sorry. But yeah, this update was pretty cold. I like a lot of things. You guys will see why I like a lot of things. But uh, yeah, don't forget that sub one yet. I really appreciate it. And uh, yeah, let's get to it. <laughs> Alright, as usual, I'm sorry while I'm recording this, but uh, yeah, let's get this out of the way. So, this is the. Actually, you know what? Um, let's do Boom. Let's do Bomb Bomb. I was gonna do Goro. Oh, wait, is it. Is it slash death bomb bomb? I was gonna do Goro Goro first, but uh yeah, let's just go ahead and do bomb bomb fruit. Okay, so you probably all seen this. Um I'll actually go back to Del Fruit, I mean just level zero, so you guys can see the stat requirements for the moves. So max is 85, so yeah. Um this fruit is good. Definitely the best Paramecy in the game right now. I don't know if the Halloween event is including any fruits besides Goro and uh Bomu, obviously. But uh, yeah, let me just go ahead and level myself 105 because that's the current max. But the new max is going to be added soon. Um, level 105. All right. So yeah, I'm going to go ahead and put 85 into the Delph Root stat for this route right here. Here we go. Okay. So the first move for Bomu Bomu is Explosive Leap. Uh, it's just a launch into the air. This is what it does. Longer you charge it, higher you go. Note this is like really good if you're a Sky Peon because you can use the wings. I don't know if we're actually like all automatically Sky Peons in here. Now we're not. Okay. I don't know how to change the race either. That's a certain command. I do not know that command. So uh, yeah. But this thing does damage as well and has like a really low cooldown. I'll actually go ahead and use it. It's going to be hard to hit in the middle of a fight though purely because you're not a Logia. Bomb also gets a custom dash passive as you guys can see. So uh, yeah. That's cool. Um, it's a pretty dope fruit overall. One of my favorite Paramecia is definitely like the best Paramecia. I'm pretty sure that this dash is like longer than the automatic dash too. So it's nice. Doesn't do damage, I'm pretty sure. And you can always just dash and leap away. You can you can dash in the air too, which is really cool. You can actually dash in the air like that. So that's awesome. Second move. This is the coolest bomb in my opinion. Explosive swipe. Wherever you put your cursor, an explosion gets set off there. It's really, really cool. I like this one the most. Let me go stop getting hit. Uh, I'm actually going to push this one out of the aggro zone so I can actually see the range of this. So the max range is, wow, that's actually really far. That's good. <laughs> that's really good. Okay, uh, that's a little surprising. That is a little surprising. I'm not going to lie. Lock you down a little bit again. And then I can literally go all the way over there and just set it off. Okay, cool. Uh, I'm going to use leap to finish you off. Then this. And it holds you in the air too, so you can use it to like not get killed and stuff like that. I'm going to go ahead and knock this off, though. Okay. Next move is Explosive Mines. This one's a cool one. Um, I should have... You know what? Let me... 
Let me reset my, uh, let me just go ahead and give myself a little 500, bro. Hold up. I'm going to go ahead and give myself 500 in all stats. I'll give myself a thousand stamina actually purely because I don't want to have to stop for stamina while I'm recording this. That's a little annoying, but, uh, yeah. it's explosive mind move. Basically what it does is as it implies a name, uh, it sets down minds. This is to explode people. Whenever you touch somebody, they'll explode on dead on impact. So explosive minds right here. Wait, what? Can I use it? Oh, I didn't put any. Wait, what? I have dough fruit. Okay, wait. I wasn't even using bomb. I'm stupid. Explosive. Oh, you, you have to not be moving, but that should have placed them down. Yeah, and these things do. They're, they're only doing so much damage because I have like 500 and dough fruit stat points, but trust me, these things do a lot of damage. These things do a lot of damage. You can also place down more depending on how long you're sitting there. You can also increase the range, which is cool. And the second to last move is explosive grab. Bro, I know y'all are getting Killer Queen references for that, bro. Killer Queen. This is the She Gale fight right here. You have to actually be like right in front of him, but you can also use it to combo really easily. And if you're fighting somebody that's like bad at the game, bro, like, you can combo into that explosive mind really good because they'll just forget about it. Bad at the game or forgetful, either one, but I'm going to show you guys how you can combo into this. So, I'm more, okay. The fruit does have a lot of mobility, though. Like I say, the fruit definitely has a crap ton, but m1 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 explosive grab that's a combo that'll work that will definitely work for sure and i wonder how long you can actually hold that but uh yeah onto the last move this last move is called self-destruct and this is one of the strongest moves in the game right now okay this is definitely one of the strongest did i just walk on my own mind why can i do that oh you gotta oh, you have to face that bro but uh yeah self-destruction this is definitely one of the strongest moves in the game it does take your own hp as like the cause for the move but in turn it does just as much damage so uh yeah the server is shutting down but uh yeah that's pretty much it for the bomb bomb fruit i can't think of anything else that's that important about the fruit all roads are pretty much fruit and uh yeah let's get into the next one all right, so right off the bat, we have the Goro Goro fruit. Right off the bat, I want y'all to know that this fruit is good. Okay, this fruit is really good. The most important thing about this fruit is a dash passive. I mean, it's not the most important thing, but it is still pretty important, and it just makes the fruit a lot better in total. Like, it has mobility. This might even be longer than the Pika Dash, and it is it's cooler for sure. So the first move is Lightning Paralyzation. Um, If you guys remember that one three sword style move, it's just like this, but uh, Lightning style, okay? And uh, yeah, it's an AoE, it's everything that you actually get in that spear. Plus, Lightning is a Logia, so yeah, you can actually not get attacked. It also stuns, it's move stuns, as you guys see. So, this would be broken in like an actual team battle. One more of those would have killed. Now, I have 500 in Delfruit stat, and it's not like doing a crap ton of damage. So, you can obviously see that this is like a move that's obviously gonna take some skill to use. But uh, yeah, moving on to the next move, we have Flash Smash. This is a really cool move too. The range is actually really good. So you charge up and then you go to your enemy and wherever you go, you'll teleport there pretty much instantly, I think it is. It's just like the light move, it's instant. But you do have like a slight, like a few seconds, maybe like one, two seconds to block. Pretty sure this is gonna block break though. So yeah, let me go ahead and use this. Yeah, it's pretty much instant. I think that's instant at least. Next move is Drag Lightning Wrath. This is broken. One of the strongest lightning moves for sure. The thing that makes this most busted is that it launches your enemy into the air, which means that they can be comboed, and it also stuns, so it's broken. But uh, yeah, here's the damage. Hits over and over and over again, which makes it like really powerful. I don't really have to showcase that since Foe's done it like 10 times in Discord now. But uh, yeah. Second, second to last move is Lightning Dragon. Here's the move, and what it does is sends out a Lightning Dragon. Does 100 damage at 500 sat, which is pretty good. Honestly, it's one of my favorite moves because of how cool it is. I would say it's a little slow though, considering. Okay, that is way too loud. Uh, can I lower that? Oh god. But uh, yeah, I say maybe make it a little faster. But this fruit is already branded as it is, so probably not a good idea. But uh, yeah, here's the move again. That's actually pretty fast. Why am I capping for? I'm not trying to be too, too, too broken. But uh, yeah, the move that everybody obviously wants to see is the Thunder Greeting. Okay, I'll go ahead and showcase that it's on these. This dude is going to be good with Gepo for sure, or Skypean. Skypean within this update just became a meta race so fast just because of how broken the glide crap is. But uh, yeah, here's the El Rigo, it's called, but Thunder Greeting, I guess, is the translation. And uh, yeah. 
brain dead brain dead <laughs> brain dead it's it's brain dead dude it, it's brain dead this fruit is broken goro is definitely one of the stronger fruits it, it's going to be one of the stronger fruits like there's no if and or buffs a but about it bro it's gonna be one of the stronger fruits okay that's just that okay so this is like a little accessory thing nothing so important but two new things will be coming into the shop in grand piece online now the first of which is the striker the second of which is the music snail so if you guys notice when i press m and go to settings there's an option to mute others music this is really cool because what this means is that foyu has added in uh, how do I explain this? Basically, you can make like your own music using a snail. But uh, yeah, the striker and the coffin boat are both legendary. I don't get why the coffin boat doesn't have like that cool ring around it. But hey, that's just me. Um, but uh, I'm gonna have to heal this, aren't I? The striker is here. This thing is very fast. Goes to 100 speed in total. I'm not gonna repair that because I'm too lazy to do that. But uh, yeah, very fast boat. Um, I don't know how to get the music snail. Yeah, I have no clue to do that. Oh, let me ask the testers. They're saying slash I. Okay, yeah. Another thing coming to this update, there's a lot of hollow. <laughs> Another thing coming to this update, there's a lot of like uh, Christmas stuff. So I slash candy cane. No, it doesn't work. I slash Santa hat maybe slash I Santa hat. Yeah, it doesn't work. Okay. Unfortunate. I don't know how to actually get those, but we'll be getting a few new accessories as well. The candy cane. Um all right there we go okay but uh, yeah i'll go ahead and showcase this new crap so we have the candy cane it's a new weapon i think it's gonna be limited time for the christmas event i'll need to put some stats into sword for this though let me go ahead and do that uh level 500 uh here we go so i'll put 500 no, i'll put 250 into my sword and we'll see how much damage this does oh it has okay so the first skill is called sweet treat Second is called Flash Freeze, and I have actually yet to test this. This is my first time testing this with you guys, so yeah, let's go ahead and see this. All right, Sweet Treat. Oh, it heals. That's a heal, isn't it? That's a heal. That's a really cool. That's a that's a that's a really good heal. I just healed ten health instantly. That's really cool. That is really cool. Okay, okay that's awesome. That's awesome. All right, uh, Flash Freeze. Oh, that's cool. That's cool. That's cool. It might look a little underwhelming, but like you guys got to realize, this is an event only thing. You can eat the candy cane and it'll give you a heal buff. Oh, that's really cool. I'm so hyped for this update, man. That's really, really cool. Okay, I like that a lot. I wasn't expecting it to be this good. I really was not. Okay, but Flash Freeze. This is kind of like Brooks thing. Oh, the range on that. It's not that long. It's like a like a miniature pheasant beak, but it is it is really cool still. Okay, um... Next up, I think we have the Santa hat. Let me go ahead and try to use that real quick. Okay, slash I Santa hat. You know, it doesn't work. Okay. All right, so we have I slash I. Is it slash I Santa's bells? Wait, 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 wait. Slash I Santa's bells. All right, there we go. And then we also have slash I Santa's hat. There we go. Okay, awesome. So we have Santa's bells and Santa's hat. These are these are two accessories. Santa's hat exclusive. What is vanity? I don't know what that means. Um, I'll go ahead and equip this though. Let's see what it does. I didn't gain any stats. Um, oh, it took my hair away, dude. What? I don't want that. What does this do? All right, you know what? I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna question it. Uh, I have. Wait, what does the Santa? Wait, what does the Santa's hat do? Maybe the testers would know. I, I just sent a message in the Discord. Um, but uh, let's test this out. The jingle bells to heal and attack. Okay. All right, so this has to be heals. These have to be heals pass. These have to be heal passives. There's nothing else this could be, right? I'm pretty sure. Uh, let me try. Let me try getting hits. Dang, being a logia sucks when you actually want to get hit. Uh, oh, wait, wait, wait a second, wait a second. Did I just heal like twenty instantly? All right, I'm gonna assume that these two are just heal passives, which is pretty good. So yeah, if you want these, definitely be sure to get them. Um. I'm not too sure how. Oh, okay. I'm stupid. So this actually has like a healing thing. You can actually attack with this too. What? You can hit, bro. You can hit with this. All right. That's kind of wacky. But how much damage is this? Do I wonder? Let's try it. What? This thing is broken, bro. Dog. What is that? This thing is a whole weapon. Oh, that's busted. And it heals you. I just regen a lot of health, by the way. I'm gonna let them hit me for a bit, and then when I when I actually get my thing off cooldown, which is like now actually, so I should really stop. 
I regen fast though. Alright, wait. Back off me. Let me take the Santa hat off because I think that's impacting my regen. This is it without Santa hat. This is it with 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 it on. And then this is the healing rhyme. Okay, yeah, that actually did not do as much as I thought it would. Bro. I'm not gonna lie. But uh, yeah. Okay, so next up we have the golden staff. This is Eno's weapon. Um, so yeah, here it is. Okay, golden staff. Probably the strongest weapon featured in this update. And if you have the Goro Goro no Mi, it gets a lightning effect, which I did not know. That's cool. That is very cool. I did not know anything about it getting a lightning effect. That's awesome. All right, that's cool. That's very cool. I wonder if that transfers to other weapons too. Oh no, okay, just, just I know stuff. All right, it's probably made of like a special metal or some crap like that. All right, so here's the emu, rapid thrust. You attack fast. That's pretty much it. <laughs> you you just attack fast. Still cool though. Still cool. Much appreciated. Here's the second move. Golden sweep. You also attack fast. Uh, now the last move. I don't know what that move is right there. It's just question mark question. Meaning it's not like finished or whatever. Then here's pull counter. I've never seen this before yet. Don't know what this is supposed to do. Maybe it's like a kick or something like that. Like how Sanji like kicks I, I don't know dog what is this what's this supposed to be we have to mm. how am i gonna hit this though like there's no way i'm gonna hit this wait i'm a logia i forgot that i did kind of forget that oh it does have a custom blocking animation too that's cool but uh yeah uh let me try to hit this on you uh i don't think i did anything dog all right, well, that's probably some sort of counter ability. Maybe I can't use unless an actual player. Um, I'll try one more time because maybe I'm bugging, but like from the way it's looking, I don't think that even works, dude. Uh, okay, let me try one more time. Um, just block this here. Okay, okay, block. Okay, here's the pull counter. Hey, maybe I'm doing something wrong. I don't know, but uh, yeah, that's it for Goro, and that's also it for the. This thing is fast. Why is this thing so fast now? It wasn't that fast before, I swear. But uh, yeah, on to the next thing. This is another small thing, but uh, yeah, as I pointed out earlier, there'll be music snails. I just figured out how to actually get them though, so I guess I'll go ahead and showcase it. Device used to play music. Um, sound ID. Uh, let me go ahead and test this out. Can I actually play? Like a sound ID if I actually try it. Hold up. So let me mute this music. Where I'm about to go into next is the Sky Island. My boy JD, Sendox Naruto. You all know him. Go sub to his channel. It's actually named Sendox Naruto. So go sub to him. But uh, yeah, he's about to go take me to the Sky Island where I'll show you guys a few things. So there is also a Santa boss. I don't know if I'll get to that in this video. I most likely will because I'm trying to be a little thorough with it. But uh, yeah, there are two bosses I want to show off. The Eno boss, which is where you'll probably get this staff from. Okay, so I don't know if you guys can see this right here, but this is the way to get to Skypea. Um, I'm not going to showcase the exact way because I do want there to be some things that you guys can find out for yourselves. I don't want to spoil you guys with all this information, but uh, yeah, this is pretty cool. Um, I should be able to just go over here and just go ahead and climb up there, if I'm not mistaken. Thanks again for taking me, JD. This is through to the skies. Yes, sir. All right. Wait for this water stream to spawn, then ride your ship on it. Make sure your ship is enough speed. Uh, I don't really need to do that. <laughs> yeah, if you have Pika, you could just fly up here. Same for Mira, I guess, if you have enough time and stamina. But uh, yeah, I won't show you guys exactly how to get here because I, I do want you guys to figure out some things for yourselves. But uh, yeah, um, as you guys can see, there's like a little road down there. I'm gonna go ahead and hop on down here. My frames, dude. My frames are just dying. I'm gonna follow JD. JD knows what he's doing. I do not. So that's that down there. That's base Skypea. Ignore that. What I want to show you guys is up here. Uh, is this it? That's just Robo. Okay, I don't care about Robo too much. Okay, my frames, my frames, yeah. If you have a trash PC, bro, not to say my PC's trash, but this is not for you, bro. <laughs> this is not for you. This this place is the frames on the frames on Skype here is crazy. It's draining the hell out of my PC right now. Also, I should have muted that music the moment I heard it. Uh, where's Enel at? Does he spawn here? Does Enel spawn over here? I'm guessing Enel spawns here. What is this? Oh, this is the Ken Hockey Trainer. This is the Kanaki trainer. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. 
Want to learn how to evade attacks? Yes, sir. Am I allowed to showcase all this? Okay, yeah. Um, but for this, you have to perfect block 200 times. <laughs> so, uh, yeah, have fun. Slash I burn bazooka. All right, I'll go ahead and showcase this and I'll end the video on this. So this is the burn bazooka. Um, it's an, another cannon. I don't know what you get this from, but uh, I think I need like a, does this even have a skill? You can charge this up by the way as well. Um, I'll go ahead and reset my level again. Size level 500. Um, this dude is about to shoot me, bro. I swear to God, JD. You know, I'll put all my points into gun mastery. Why not? Go ahead. I gotta reload it too. My animation just broke. My animation just broke. Okay. I think my animations are broken. Yeah. My animations are broken, but as y'all can see, the more you charge it, the more destructive it gets. So it's pretty cool. Um, That's about it for update one, y'all. We have, oh, the Santa boss, the Santa boss too. I'll actually not showcase that though. I'll probably, I'll probably wait, actually, you know what? Where's the Santa boss? If JD knows where it is, then I'll showcase it. But wait, 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 wait. What is that on your back, bro? I need the Tomo. How do you? Wait, 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 wait. I need the Tomo rings too. I need the Tomo rings too. I want to showcase those as well. I didn't realize those were a thing. So and those Tomo rings are gonna be in the game too. That's cool. Slash I Tomo drums. Okay, cool, cool, cool. Okay, cool. So, Tomoe Jumps, these obviously are going to increase the damage of the Goro Goro no Mi. At least that's what I'd assume. Maybe not. Maybe so. I would assume that that's what that would do. But, uh, yeah. This is it. It's been your boy. And uh, don't forget to hit that sub button. I'd really appreciate it. And I think JD wants to go do the Snow Boss. But I'll catch y'all in the next. Ah, fine. 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 I'll do it. I'll do the Snow Boss. Okay, I'm only doing the Snow Boss because JD knows where it is. Otherwise, I would not be doing this right now. Wait, is, is it here? What is he doing? Is it here? Like, is he just messing around? Where is it? Is it down there? Or maybe it's down here. Uh, what are these NPCs? Are, are one of these a snow boss, maybe? By the way, the snow boss I'm talking about, that's just Santa. It's, it's literally just Santa. Oh, it is down here. Okay. So, where is he? Where's Santa? This is how you get Santa's hat, by the way. I'm kind of confused as to, like, where he is, but... Over here? This dude JD is bugging, bro. Where? Where is he, bro? Where? Oh, up here. Okay. My animations are just broken, dude. Oh, my God. Oh, maybe it just didn't spawn yet? Could that be it or no i think he definitely spawned oh yeah yeah there it is there's the santa boss there's a the santa boss okay yeah it definitely spawned it definitely spawned i literally see it up there yeah it spawned it spawned for sure no way it didn't spawn did they just kill it no it's still alive i think at least uh it even has elves that's really cool so that must be how you get the bells is off of the elves that's awesome and the, the presents are all bombs okay that's cool that's really cool. The presents are all bombs like that. And here's Santa. Okay. Santa, can I kill you? I don't think I can actually kill him, but that's a very cool boss. So even though this boss is overpowered, it's going to be near impossible to beat. Like, you're not beating that crap. But uh, yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one. Later.